Hello everyone and welcome back to Two Bros Game Night. I am your host, Older Bro. And I'm your other host, Younger Bro. And we continue on Undertale. Yep, we're gonna have fun here. Yeah. Oh, okay, I now. Mean... Yeah. I have to figure out how to avoid uh, this upcoming attack. Yeah, I mean. So do I just move? Yeah, I mean, it's very simple. Don't die. Well, <laughs> don't go backwards. Move! Dodge! This is oof. Yeah, that, that is this whole section. Oh. Yeah, you... The jukes! Oh! Yeah, it's it's literally just... Be good. What? You got hit. Clearly. Eh. Ha! I'm sorry, you're stopping because... What? What happened? You can't move. <laughs> A wild monster kid appeared. And dead. <laughs> well, gotta go file some reports. <laughs> She did. Does this do anything? Nope. It's just a thing. Oh. How are you not dead? Yo! Did you see that? Undyne just touched me! That doesn't sound wrong. What would you say if she picked you up by your face? Not by your head. She literally grabbed you on your face she grabbed, and lift She up. grabbed me. Well, I hate to be the bearer of bad news, sir, but unfortunately, touching someone or grabbing someone requires you to be touched by them. Yes, but it would make more sense if she would say, Undyne just grabbed me by the hey, look, head. Look, I I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying that the character also isn't wrong. No, she's not. It just <laughs> sounds weird when she puts it like that. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> Anyways... I'm never watching my face ever again. Now that sounds creepy. She is... This character is obviously a crazed fanatic for Undyne. Like, they've literally... This character has literally talked about the fact that he wants to go watch Undyne beat people up. What? Uh, yes, congratulations. I don't... I didn't pay attention uh, <laughs> to her story. Right, because as we learned from the Paper Mario series recently, you don't pay attention to stories. <laughs> Anyways, Especially man. Especially extra filler. <laughs> man, are you on like, we're going to have to have a serious conversation about what you consider filler in a story. <laughs> if you were standing just a little bit to the left, yo, don't worry. I'm sure we'll get to see her again. Oh, I'm sure. I'm okay. <laughs> uh, ooh. Here we go again. Okay, uh, let, let me. Squeak. I mean, you were you son of a? Were you expecting? He cussed me else? out. He cussed me out. <laughs> look, man. Look, man. You're just gonna have to calm down. It's okay. It's just a mouse. It's just a mouse. He cussed me out, man. You no. <laughs> hear him mocking me in there. <laughs> Knowing the mouse might one day extract the cheese from the crystal, it fills you with determination. How does that fill me with determination? Just fill the mice with determination. Ooh, You're sands. I don't know. How does anything in here fill you with determination? I'm thinking about getting into the telescope business. Like I need more jobs. <laughs> it's normally 50,000 G to use this premium, premium telescope. But since I know you, you can use it for free. How's, how's about it? Use the telescope? Yes. Wow. Such insight! Huh? You aren't satisfied? Don't worry. I'll give you a full refund. It's an odd looking telescope. <laughs> That's funny. It's sad. Sands, you <laughs> son of a. Uh, no wonder he's smiling. Use the box? 
Well, it looks like there's nothing you need to worry about for the box. Just wanted to make sure. Yep. Um, talk to you this guy. What's a star? Can you touch it? Can you eat it? Can you kill it? Are you a star? <laughs> uh, do we go this way? Or uh, the the path you're supposed to be going is that way, so go up first. Go up? Yeah. Hey, Mr. Meeseeks! I relocated my... Oh, no, that that's Morty. <laughs> it's me, Mr. Meeseeks! Look at me! I relocated my store, but there's... All s are still no customers. Fortunately, I've just. Huh? I thought of a solution. Jet punch cards. Every time you buy a ice cream, you can take a punch card from the box. If you have three cards, you can. Dang, I keep, I, I, I go from Mr. Meeseeks, then into freaking Morty. <laughs> Mr. Meeseeks, you can trade them for a free nice cream. They're sure to get the customers to come back. Unlike the, yeah, unlike your voice, which is unlikely to get okay, the customers I, to come done. back. Okay, I'm done. I'm <laughs> done. Just... Mr. Meeseeks, super! His ice cream brings all the boys to the yard. Ooh. <laughs> the box contains one punch card. Take the card. So we have to find three punch cards? No, it's if you buy three nice creams right now, you'll mm -hmm. get three punch cards, which you can get a and which you can turn in for a fourth nice cream. As a piece of advice, if you want to get a free nice cream, you have to do it now, because he will leave the area. Fine. So, did I just get the free nice yeah. cream? No, now you go over and get the three punch cards. Which, you already have two of them, so take the two. Oof. Wow, I can't take more than one. You're carrying too much. So you have to go back to the other box, put an item away to get the card, to get the free ice cream, to get the item out of the box. Fine. And you can see why so few people get these punch cards. Just drop off ice cream. Okay. Back we come for the third punch card. Isn't this exciting content? Yes. <laughs> S such such item great management. Graphics. How about redeeming them for some ice cream? It's free. Yeah. Here, a free ice cream. You lost three cards and got an ice cream. Okay. Okay, I think that's kind of worth it. Plenty of ice cream. You will never run out of an ice cream. No. Nope. Okay. That out. Um, okay. Okay. Um, I should probably heal. No, I'm fine. Nope, you're good. All right, should I go this way? Down is the correct way, and uh, right. You well, you'll find out. <laughs> Robert Ducky. Yeah, you cannot get across. So, I want my ducky. Yeah, you'll have to go back. I have to go back and go all the way around. Yep. Mm. It's amazing. Um, oh, flower. <laughs> you hear, hear a passing conversation. So, don't you have any wishes to make? I wish to have better content. You hear a passing conversation. Hmm. No, you're not getting that. It's kind of stupid. <laughs> I'll kill you! <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Washua shuffles up. Oh, no. You ask Washua to clean you. Green means clean. I'm sorry. <laughs> Washua is looking for some. Nope, you got to be cleaned. You did not get cleaned because you didn't touch the green. Green means clean. Oof. Oof. Got one. 
Congratulations, you took eight damage. <laughs> Just to get one. Just to get rid of this guy. Margaret, should I be going this way first? Yep, here we are. I guess, push C. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? You got the ballet shoes. I should probably go back. Yeah, now you have to go all the way no back way to the back. items. So that you can equip the ballet shoes, so that you can swap the ballet shoes, or put the item that the ballet shoes was into the box. Yep. Uh, I think it'd be more interesting if like the clothes actually changed. But I will admit that would be interesting. Uh, but unfortunately, no. Um, I should probably equip the yeah, equip the ballet shoes. Right, that's how that works. <laughs> You do tend to need to equip the item to use the item. And now we can get rid of that second top glove that we accidentally bought. Yep. Okay. On we go. To run into probably another Washua. Maybe. Down. There's nothing that way. Nothing more that way? I don't think so. You walked into Moldspawn. You earned nothing. Ring. Hello, this is Papyrus. Remember when I asked you about clothes? Well, the friend who wanted to know, her opinion of you is very... murdery. But I bet you already knew that. <laughs> and because you knew that, I told her what you told me you were wearing. A dusty tutu. Because I knew, of course, after such a suspicious question, you would obviously change your clothes. You're such a smart cookie. This way you're safe and I didn't lie. No betrayal anywhere. Being friends with everyone is easy. Oh, Lord, Papyrus. <laughs> oh, Papyrus <sighs> do, trying to do his best. He is. And he fails at it. <laughs> you hear a passing conversation. Don't say that. Come on. I promise I won't laugh. Ha ha ha! I knew it. Yeah, yeah. I don't exactly know how to easily. Boom! Ooh! Ooh! You gained a health, sir. Boom! Ah! <laughs> uh. Boom! There we go. There's nothing else. Just straight up. Oop. About to say, don't you skip that sign? The power to take their souls. This is the power that the humans feared. Oh no! Where am I ducking? <laughs> Hi. Um. It's an anime game with tentacles in it. We should be very afraid. Oh, you might say. Hey there! Fun. Noticed you were here. I'm Onion San. Onion San, you hear? Hold on. This guy reminds me of someone. Oh, who it is? Who is it? Like his face is so familiar. Oh, um, I I know who it reminds me of, but you don't know who he okay. is yet. Okay then. It's in Dragon Ball Super. Okay then. I'll uh get to it eventually. You're visiting Waterfall, huh? It's great here, huh? You'll love it, huh? Wait, hold on. He also looks like Onion. Come on. I mean. He did say his name is Onion San, so maybe. I mean, it's probably not. He's probably not this game's onion, but I, he's probably based on an onion. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> it's my big favorite. Okay, anime. Even though the water's getting so shallow here, I'm gonna have to fight this guy anyway. Hmm. I have to sit down all the time, but... Okay, also, how is he talking to us? Because his mouth looks like it would be underwater. It showed his mouth. It's not yeah. showing it currently. Yeah. Like, we should be hearing water sounds right now. Bloop, 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 bloop. Why do they have to sit down all the time, bloop? <laughs> hey, that's okay. It beats moving to the city. I'm moving on up. 
to the city, right. moving on up. I mean, obviously, he isn't. He explicitly doesn't want to do that. Eh. And living in a crowded aquarium, like all my friends did. We get it, you're lonely. And the aquarium's full anyway, so even if I wanted to, I... Are you asking me to carry you or something? Because that ain't going to work. <laughs> As you can see from my stature, I lack physical strength to carry you. <laughs> I mean... You haven't done a lot of strong stuff yet, but that doesn't mean that you're incapable. I mean, you've pushed some rocks and some boxes. I, look how fat I am. I don't think I'm physically capable. <laughs> <laughs> you, <laughs> and look you, at the you size of that. His head is that big too. <laughs> like exactly. Yeah. I'm fat. Most people's heads are the same size as their body or smaller than yeah. their body. Once again, look how fat I am. <laughs> this is not an argument I can win, folks. That's okay, though, you hear? Undyne's gonna fix everything, you hear? I'm gonna get out of here and live in the ocean, you hear? Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Fat guy. Hold on. Uh. Okay. Hey, there, okay? Th that's the end of this room, okay? I'll see you around, okay? Have a good time, okay? In the waterfall, okay? I have literally no idea who the heck you're talking about. South Park character. <laughs> Never watched it. That's sad. That's sad, okay? Shiren hides in the corner, but somehow encounters you anyways. <laughs> How do you spare this thing? Uh, how am I supposed to know? You figure it out. Conduct was conduct. Like, conductor. Oh. You smile. You ask to see Shiren smile, too. Shiren gets quieter in the corner. Aaron nods his head approvingly. I... Who? The flex guy. Oh. To... Hum. You hum a jazz ballad. Shire wow. follows your melody. Siren, Siri, Si me, Si me. Shiren seems much more comfortable singing aloud. Interesting. He won. You earn zero XP and thirty gold. A sign. Many signs. W which way is the right way? The northern room hides a great treasure. Okay. Is that circle? Is that uh, supposed to be circle? Or is that no. dot? It's it's saying that, like... It's, read the sign. A haunting song echoes down the corridor. Won't you play along? Only the first eight are fine. So the keys up there are saying how like to play a note. So it's saying up, down, left, right is the buttons you push to play a note. And not pushing one plays What's that. Uh... So you you hold the direction you want and then hit a button. I don't know what the button is, but I'm guessing it's like Z. Whatever button you normally are pressing. Is there a certain code or something? Yes, there's a certain code. Hmm. There is basically zero chance you're going to get this by accidentally pushing the buttons. How do you get it? By knowing what the code is. How do you find the code? That's a good question. Do we have to go over here to find it? Maybe. This power has no counter. Indeed, a human cannot take a monster's soul. When a monster dies, its soul disappears. And an incredible power would be needed to take the soul of a living monster. There is only one exception, the soul of a special species of monster called a boss monster. A boss monster's soul is strong enough to persist after death, if only for a few moments. 
A human could absorb this soul, but this has never happened, and now it never will. Am I supposed to be going this way? Yep, it's the right way. Is this undying or something? It's a statue. The structures at its feet seem dry. I feel like there's some kind of significance to this. I mean, there tends to be significance to things. I'm not getting it. Fair enough. Please take one. Take an umbrella. You took an umbrella. I'm Mary Poppins, y'all. I'm guessing we go this way? Yeah, I think if anything you could say, you're not Mary Poppins. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, yes, do this, I... This is the plot. But do I have to go this way to get the piano? I'm not gonna say. That's a secret only you can figure out. What do you mean? <laughs> I don't know what the... I would look it up at this point. Well, then that's called not exploring well enough. What do you mean? Did I miss something? What the heck did I miss? No. Is it the statue? It can't be the statue. If you're trying I... to hear something, there that is literally just a rain sound. All I remember is it talked about a song and I have to play along uh, with it. Well, do you hear a song? No. Well, then you probably don't know the code, do you? No. <laughs> so why don't you wait and find a song? Or do something to make a song appear? I don't know. I like to hear a song to appear. It has to be this. <laughs> Put the umbrella on the statue. I'm not gonna remember that. Oh, or I can figure. I can help figure it out with you. Okay. Okay. It's it's zero. Try the top note. Uh, down. Nothing. Z. Uh, right. No. Okay. Uh, leave the room and start over. Yeah, try this, this. This one. Yeah, okay, so it's lead and start over. Ooh. I think I got it. This is fun. Okay, <coughs> there we go. We'll cut, uh, we'll cut some of this out. There we go. Got it. Boom! Finally. Oof. Ooh. Well, let's read the sign. I was gonna say, can you read the sign first? No. No. Okay. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? Oh! You're carrying too many dogs. <sighs> Where am I? Uh huh. <laughs> Have a wonderful day. Your HP was maxed out. Hey, smart. It's a legendary artifact. Will you take it? You're carrying too many dogs. Annoying dog. You deployed the dog. The dog absorbs the artifact. You mother. 
<laughs> is that a joke? Yep. The artifact is gone. No, you you don't say. It is literally not possible to get that item. Which is why I didn't tell you the, the response to the puzzle, because it was time wasting pointless. So you told me not to waste my <laughs> freaking knife. <laughs> for you would have done it anyways. No, I get the not. get the umbrella. Yeah, we don't. take an umbrella. We technically took technically took two now. Yeah, screw it. Technically, the statue has the other one, so you didn't take it. Yo, you got an umbrella? Awesome. Let's go. Boom, 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 boom. I like how she just does not stay under the umbrella. Yep. <clears throat> Okay, well now you just messed it up. <laughs> now, now they're in front of you, and now they're behind you. <whistles> Yo, Undyne's the best. She beats up bad guys and never loses. If I was a human, I would wet the bed every night. Bad guy? How dare you? They are monsters, and they think that humans want to immediately exterminate them. Would you, not, would you not call them bad guys if you knew that some group of people was trying to murder you? Or imprisoning you? I'm not a part of their war. You're a human. Yes, you are. <laughs> Knowing she was going to beat me up? Haha. So, one time, we had a school project where we had to take care of the flower. The king, we had to call him Mr. Dreamer, volunteered to donate his own flowers. Mm -hmm. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking. Yo, how cool would it be if Undyne came to school? Oh, dang. She could beat up all the teachers. Haha. <laughs> I don't think you're wrong. Um... Maybe she wouldn't beat up the teachers. She's too cool to ever hurt an innocent person. You don't say. Congratulations, you figured out the irony. This is a nice shot. Bye. Bye, have a beautiful time. I'm guessing we put the umbrella back? Yep. Return the umbrella? You return to the umbrella. Yo, this ledge is way too steep. Yo, you, you want to see Undyne, right? Climb on my shoulders. Yo, you go on ahead. Don't worry about me. I always find a way to get through. Oof, I'm okay. <laughs> Oh, so ominous. Yeah, we need to save here. The serene sound of a distant music box. It fills you with determination. You know, that music box that you turned on. Okay. Let's go. Okay. Well, well, no, we're out of time. Oh, we are? Well, we'll finish this first, though. Yeah. The human's afraid of power. They attack suddenly. Blah, blah, blah. In the end, it could hardly be called a war. United, the humans were too powerful, and us monsters too weak. We have the power of one human. Not a single soul was taken, and countless monsters were turned to dust. Ooh. Okay. So, next time on Two Bros Game Night, we will we see where the heck we're going. I think we're going to battle Undyne or whatever. Well, either we're going to battle Undyne or we're going to get closer to battling Undyne. But until then, every night may be a game night. But only tonight is a two bros game night. See you next game <laughs> night. See ya.